All right, so I guess we'll get our, our session started today. Um, anyone can chime in. Uh, I'd like to start with getting an idea of uh, the homework that you were able to accomplish um, and how did the week go? I noticed uh, a big difference uh, in, in doing the exercises. At first, I, I was just a bit frustrated because um, it didn't seem like the morning CP was going up. Um, but when I finally taped my mouth, <laughs> and I found out that I do open my mouth at night. <laughs> <laughs> My my wife would say you're you're breathing on the side of your tape, so. Um, uh, but I noticed uh, even the first night, the next day, um, just by keeping my mouth closed the majority of the time, I imagine that I saw a definite improvement, and um, I I could tell, um, and things that. Uh, normally would would bother me as far as triggers for my asthma mm. um, it just seemed like it was all falling into place to be able to control it uh, even the um, uh, feeling um, your your breath in the exercises to find that comfort zone you know and uh, i began to feel it um how should I say that? Uh, you know, at first you seem a little uncomfortable when you're starving a little bit for breath, but then it seems like you get into the zone and it just, it's natural. And I understand when she was saying, this is totally natural. I, I hadn't gotten to that point yet. Mm -hmm. And I can't say I always stay in it, but um, I'm beginning to feel what it's like. Um, as I mentioned to you when I wrote um, Saturday, we drove to um, my son's house. We hadn't seen each other because of this sheltering in place for several months, and uh, it's in Austin. And when I visit here, there's always a lot of triggers for me. He has dogs, he has an upstairs, and all these things I would visit here would, would trigger. And um, I found myself just uh, being very conscious of it. And every, if I began to show a little bit of shortness of breath, I just made sure my mouth was closed and then slowed my breathing down. Mm -hmm. Never had to take any, any inhaler or anything like that. So I was very pleased that uh, because here, when I get here, sometimes it's just so many things that would cause my asthma and allergies. Uh, there's another thing that I noticed uh, when I was able to do the breathing exercises before was that um, uh, the allergies that I normally would feel in the morning, and I told you about that also. I would get up in the morning and have, you know, uh, sneezing, runny nose, and all that. But when I was able to To get closer and build down that CP, it seemed like uh, I didn't have those issues in the morning, or, or a lot less. So that's that's where I'm at. Mm. Oh, that's excellent. That's excellent. I'm uh, really glad to glad to hear that. Uh, there we go. Um, and it's and that's the thing when you experience the benefits. That's when the belief kicks in. You know, until then, it's like, oh, you know, I, it makes sense. But until you experience it, that's when it becomes solidified. You know, that's when it becomes real. And so, you know, hats off to you for really um, persevering through that initial challenge, that initial speed bump. Because I'm sure, you know, like anything in life, that's, it's, it's the same way. There is a little learning curve. There is a little, you know, barrier that you have to break through. Um, even as something as simple as learning how to ride a tricycle, you know, when we were all younger, you know, it wasn't, you know, that easy to even ride a tricycle the first go around, you know, all awkward and, and everything, but you had someone there 
maybe your dad or your mom coaching you and say, hey, you can do it, you can do it. You know, and before you know it, you're, you know, off on a two-wheeler, you know, popping wheelies here and there, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, but it's no different than even learning something new as far as your breathing. Um, and, and so hats off to you. Excellent stuff. How about yourself, Joe? Myself, um, I've seen a lot of improvement. I am able to wake up and uh, not have to worry about gasping for air. Uh, I think totally, you know, all the different things that, that I have learned have helped. It seemed like I wasn't getting anywhere. And uh, I know that uh, that 20 seemed so far to reach. And uh, all of a sudden here, Yesterday, I did make a 20 from a morning CB, and today it was 22. So I said, whoa. <laughs> so, so it's, so I think now it's getting, it's kicking in the different things that I've learned. Sure. And uh, so I'm real happy with it. Excellent, excellent. Um, 